these are some examples. Specifically, what you want to alter in your student learning target are these three factors. First and foremost, you have the population. And so you could say that half of your class, the upper half of your class or the lower half of your class, is going to do something. And then you just pick the standardized test you want to use to make sure it's consistent. And you set that goal. And what I would like to you to do is incorporate the pretest data into the actual student learning target. So say, I want the majority of my students, or I want 75% of my students who scored below a 20 to now score above a 30. Now you say that you want a certain majority or percent because not every student, even if you set the goal, will achieve that goal. This keeps you safe and keeps the goal reasonable. Don't expect 100% of 100% to do 100%. Okay? 